What's up everyone, this is Tech Break, and in this video we're going to have a speed comparison test between the new 4K iMac, the MacBook Pro Retina, and the last generation of the iMac. In this video we're going to have several speed tests, so let's get started with this video. The first test we're going to do is going to be a boot up test on all three of these machines. If you guys would like to find the specs of each individual computer, they're going to be listed down below in the description box. So of course the MacBook Pro starts out first, and that's only because it has an SSD while both of the other iMacs do not. So the MacBook Pro finished with a time of 14 seconds, the new 4K iMac finished with a time of 32 seconds, and I had to speed it up for the last generation of the iMacs because it took a really long time coming in at a minute and three seconds. Up next is the Geekbench test, and you can install the Geekbench on your computer, so if you want to compare the results from the machines featured in this video to your own computer, you could do so. On the MacBook Pro, we got a single core score of 2,976 and a multi core score of 6,340. On the last generation iMac, we have the scores featured above. The new 4K iMac got a single core score of 3,416 and a multi core score of 11,502. So there's a very large difference between all these different machines. Up next, we're using Cinebench, and this tests the performance of the graphics and the processor on each of the machines. Here's the end results for each three of these machines, and you can tell right here that the MacBook Retina did a really poor job compared to the other iMacs. The final test we have is going to be downloading a 4K movie from the SD card onto the computer. So right here we have the old generation of the iMac, and each clip is going to be the same 4K movie, and the 4K movie is a minute and 53 seconds long. So it took the last generation iMac about 17-18 seconds to download the movie. Up next we have the new 4K iMac. And this took about the same amount of time, about 17 to 18 seconds, to download the same movie. Surprisingly enough, the MacBook Pro Retina came in about the same time, about 17 to 18 seconds. Well, that concludes the speed test for the new 4K iMac, the last generation iMac, and the new MacBook Pro Retina. If you guys have any questions and concerns, please drop a comment down below. If you did enjoy this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you didn't, give me a thumbs down. I'll see you guys in the next one, and this is Tech Break, signing off. Peace.